We are Percepta Machina, and this is Extreme Fencing. We built an interactive game based on fencing. Each player has four target zones. When a zone lights, players have three seconds to strike that target zone. If the zone is hit, the player loses health. Each player carries an Arduino, custom shield, a battery, and an XB wireless radio. The target zones are made up of layers. The top layer is a metal screen that is pulled high by the Arduino. Underneath is a layer of LED lights powered by a custom Arduino shield. Both players' swords are wired to a common ground. When the sword hits a target, the metal screen is grounded and pulled low, registering a touch. The Arduinos on the vest communicate wirelessly to the master Arduino on the scoreboard. There is a laptop connected to the scoreboard LED panels. The master Arduino notifies this laptop of any game state changes, and it animates the scoreboard display. Hey, I'm Bill Shaw. I organized the team, I did all of the Arduino programming, and I'm on the sensors. My name is Daniel Nair. I spent 15 years repairing and designing digital LED displays. I came up with the concept to detect where the sword touches on the vest and designed a custom Arduino shield to read the touches and drive the LED lighting on the vest. Hi, I'm John Adair. I built the scoreboard animations, wired the vests, and created this video. Hi, I'm Anna Adair, and my responsibility on this team was to build these electrified exoskeletons for our fencers. We held several public build sessions and our demo at Tampa's Museum of Science and Industry. We also presented our build to families attending an Arduino class in Moses Ideas Now.